Hey, what is up guys? It's Prodigy and I'm here with another Minecraft mob battle. And today basically it'll be I'm actually adding I added a new mod into the series. And this mod will also be in the survival series. You might be able you might recognize some of the um objects in my hotbar from this mod because it's a pretty popular mod. I added in the better dungeons mod and a lot I think all yes all of the battles will be centered pretty much around better dungeons and I think uh, not all of these are boss battles but I mean we're doing four battles today instead of three just cuz it can and whatever and this series is going to take a while but you know whatever another thing about the uh, better dungeons mod is you can force mobs to fight each other however I have noticed that does not work very well with the Eternal Isles mobs. It works with some of them, a few of them, but not most of them. It, uh, yeah. But anyway, let's get to the first battle, which is the Necromancer versus the Apparition. For, and the Necromancer, as you might be able to guess, is from the Better Dungeons mod. Apparition is from the Eternal Isles mod. And it will be six against one, because they have, because, you, know, you know, he, he has 300 health and they have 50, so, I mean, okay. Okay, you, sir, right there, attack this guy. And Hadouken, he's just killing everything. And let's make him attack this guy too, oh crap. Let's make him attack this guy too. And also, as you can see guys, the Necromancer has some pretty cool abilities. abilities. And he's actually taken some damage there. That was, I believe, the first apparition. Oh god. Okay, hit him. Hit him in the face. Hit him in the face. And the apparition just deals so much damage. He's deal he's killing all this guy's minions in two hits. Oh god. The minions have 25 health, and this guy's dealing 20s and 15s to the necromancer, because I guess he's got a little bit of higher defense. And so he couldn't handle two. I think, I mean, he didn't even, yeah, so that that's kind of sad. It's a little bit disappointing, not a very epic battle, but the apparitions will be moving on to the next round, and yes. So let me, yeah, alright, let me just uh, turn down the sounds and stuff. Uh, 8% should be good. And then let me get rid of all these extra mobs. I've tried to do all these things at the same time, but since the arena is so big, it, the mobs tend to wander, and um, other mobs spawn, so I'm just going to need to spawn in one at a time. So, the next battle will be the pirate versus the mosquito swarm, so, unfortunately, that's not going to be very epic. I mean, you know, it's a pirate versus a swarm of mosquitoes. As you can see, the pirates actually come with armor sometimes, but, uh, yeah. I'm not even sure if the mosquito swarm aggro's against them, but uh, I mean, whatever. Why not? Why not involve them? And I mean, I'll know for the next season if you guys want another season because I honestly like doing these mob battles. But uh, yes, oh god, and smack them. I'm wondering if you guys can actually see the mosquito swarm. They're really hard to see against the obsidian. Anyway, each mosquito swarm has 12 health and. Uh, the pirate has, oh, well actually I should have just put him against one, but whatever. He wins, and I'm lagging like really bad. Alright, cool. So I'm just going to move back to the, I think he won. Yeah, he won, whatever. How could he not have won? So this is going to be a giant slime, hold on a minute. A giant slime, which is a new, I should also say that they added in a lot of new bosses, but also took away a few bosses as well. So, if you're wondering, like, what all these, what this mob is, it's one of the newer bosses, so yeah, it's pretty cool. But anyway, this is the giant slime. It has 450 health, summons in other slimes that will actually head towards it, and when it makes contact, it will heal him, which is kind of cool and stuff. So next, it is against six surveyors. And thankfully, he is naturally aggressive, that's pretty cool. And I think I actually can do more than one surveyor at a time, as he, as they will all aggro if one is attacked. Four, five, six. 
They aren't. They are just aren't in the aggro range yet. So just give them a minute. Oops. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Oh god. Oh crap. The lag. I hate it. I hate it so much. Giant slime. Attack these guys over here. Booshki. Hadouken. Hadouken. Attack him in the face. Hadouken. There's one surveyor up there. What the surveyors do is they throw a lot. Like they throw everything. And yeah, so as you can see, the giant slime is kind of like a frog looking dude. It's pretty cute. He's got a really cool model. I like it. I like it a lot. He's also got some pretty cool abilities. Better dungeons mobs always do. But I'm not sure if he can do it, guys. I mean, I, I'm seeing some weakened surveyors, but uh, I don't know, man. The giant slime's taking some damage, too. And there are still a lot of surveyors left. Oh, crap. Oh, man. Oh, this is intense. Oh, snap. Are you going to attack them? You should attack them. That's a good idea. Attack them. Attack them. Gosh darn it. Now attack them. Gosh darn you. Attack it. Okay, so there we go. Okay, killed that one. Uh, one, two, three. I'm seeing three. Are there more left? Uh, oh god, there's... Okay, I see there's one more over there. Oh my gosh, she's gonna win. What is he down to? You're freaking regening. Okay, so he's got 450 health, so he's gonna need to be down to 175, I believe. No, that's incorrect. 225, duh. Yeah, attack him. Kick him in the face. Kick him in the face. So, yeah. We might end up doing another round, because as you can see, the slimes actually, whenever they make contact, they like regen. He regens, so that's pretty cool. And gosh dang it, keeps keep staying like out of his anger range. Oh my god, you are quick. Or right, I'm not sure if that's actually the giant slime doing that or, or the surveyor, because I know the surveyor likes to throw. I think that was the surveyor. I think that one was the surveyor. Yeah, I think that was all the surveyor. I'm not really sure, because I know he's like a frog and he jumps. I think that was him. But anyway, I think he's won this round. Okay, and we're back, and we're we are in this uh, smaller arena here. I just uh. Wanted to make sure that they didn't de-aggro for the second round like they did last time, because they did that a lot. Alright, so, Giant Slime, I think, uh, okay, Giant Slime and Surveyors, one, two, three, four, five, six. Now, he's naturally aggressive, so that's cool. I think he's preparing to attack. Oh, snap, yep, they're all after him now. So, I thought the slimes would attack the other guys, like the surveyors, but I guess not. I guess their sole purpose is to heal them, which is actually pretty cool. I mean, a lot of the better dungeons mobs uh, summon in minions, which I will count for the battles. But, uh, this guy's minions just heal him. They're like a bunch of medics coming to aid him. So, I'll also give him an advantage because his uh, minions will be able to get to him quicker. And he'll be able to heal faster. And it's really hard to tell which is him. Oh, there he is. Aha. I'm glad I'm glad he's not just, like, an enormous slime. I'm glad, he, I'm glad they kind of made him look, like, different. Like a frog, kind of. Kick them in the face, Mr. Froggy Dude. Oh, wait, is he winning? There's three surveyors left. He's taken out half of them. And how low is he? If he wins again this round, then he moves on to the next round of, uh, you know, mob tournament, because that's what, exactly what this is, tournament-style stuffs. Oh, actually, he's getting taken down. The surveyors are powerful, dude. Oh, but they can't go near him when he's like that. Oh, crap. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. Oh, they're down. Oh, they're down. And the giant slime is victorious, and he's summoning, it, summoning in uh, little other slimes. Oh, yeah. All right, so... uh yeah, alright, so I'm gonna pause it, next battle will be, uh, 12 death, t no, 13, 12 death, yeah, I don't know, I need to do the math again, a certain amount of death tokens versus the turtle boss, so yeah, I can just, I'm gonna pause it. Alright, we're back, and the tur this is the turtle boss here from the Better Dungeons mod, he is entering the arena at 400 health. The death tomes here are basically flying books. They are from the Twilight Forest mod, and they each have 30 health. 
There will be 13 going against him, and if he kills all of them, which I have some confidence that he will, uh, then he gets to move on to the next round if they don't get him down to half health. Oh, oops, peaceful. Haha, -ha, yeah. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Alright, and they're attacking him. They're kicking him in the face. I'm not sure they're going to be able to do it, guys, because when this guy gets down to, I think, I think it's past 50, he gets a crazy regeneration effect. Like, if you guys remember back to the uh, Eternal Isles mod showcase, there was a mob called the, I think it was the Iasaur, and the Iasaur regen like crazy throughout, and the, and the Iron Golems, like four Iron Golems couldn't kill it because of that. This is that kind of regen once he gets past 50 health. So they would need to deal, I'm going to guess, 10 hearts of damage per second if they are to kill him, and I don't think they can do that. They're dealing like 7 every 3 seconds. That was a good hit right there. I mean, you know, he's taking some damage. He's actually taking a good amount of damage. And there are books and paper everywhere, in case you didn't notice, that's what they drop, because, you know, they're, they're books. They're literally, like, books. I mean, you know. They're all attacking him, because I, I didn't even need to force them to fight, because they were, like, these guys just, like, stupid enough to attack him. Here we go, dude. I'm going to need you. Oh, crap. Chop quest turtle. Kick him in the face. Didn't actually click on him, but whatever. I'm going to need to fix this up here. All right. So, yes. Got this dude. Don't make me force you to fight them. All right. So, fight this guy. Kick him in the face. Turtle dude, kick him in the face. Kick, kick him in the face. Are you going to do anything? Are you planning on doing anything, sir? Oh, here it goes. Here it goes. Oh, snap. That's a spin move. All these bosses from better dungeons are just so cool. All their attacks are just really awesome. I love how they all just have, like, more than one attack. Unlike the, um, like, the Ender Dragon and the Wither. They, like, all have one attack, and they just, you know, it's, they're difficult, but not really entertaining to fight because of just having one attack. And, oh, snap, he's going for it. He, oh, man, what's he doing? Oh, man, attack this guy here. Boom. Kick him in the face. I've said that so many times this time. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, he's going. Oh, he's going for it. He's going for it. Oh, my gosh. He killed it. All right. Now kick this one in the face. Kick him in the face. Kick him in the face. Kick him in the face. I know you want to, man. And for some reason, um, one of the turtles attacks, the bubble attack, where he, like, he can fire out a bubble through his mouth and, like, oh. Okay. Turtle boss wins. Wait. Did they take him down past half? Ooh, they did. All right. So I guess we'll go into a round two. 13 death tones. So I think he aggroed he aggroed most of them. I'll say that. I actually want to get a new turtle boss spawner so that I can just so that I can uh make him fight some if he doesn't feel like it. All right. So that's good. Oh, he's going for it. He is so intense. I love the intensity of this battle. Look at him. Look at him. He's moving like a friggin' race car. It's like, he's, he's actually more like a really slow monster truck, but whatever. Look at this guy. He's ridiculous. Spinning. Actually, the spinning's really epic. But, you know, I mean, you know, he's a turtle. He's, he's, he's a turtle. I'm not sure if you guys noticed, but he's a turtle. And I like that he goes back in his shell. I mean, all these really attacks are pretty cool. I mean, really. I mean, I wish all bosses had, like, as creative attacks as this guy and all the other, um, better dungeon stuff do. Because all these bosses are really freaking cool. Oh, he's spinning. He's, sp oh my gosh, he's kicking the face in of that one. Oh, jeez. And, oh, he's, she's doing the intense attack again. He's slowly, oh, oh crap. Oh, man. Oh, man, here it goes. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay, yeah. He missed. I think I, he kind of missed. That that stinks. I should make, I could make him attack those guys, but I don't know. I don't want to. I don't really want to. I think a lot of the better dungeons bosses are actually instantly aggroed. Or uh, they'll attack everything on, on site, but, uh, hmm. I, I guess he just has a generally short aggro range, maybe? Is that why he's not? I don't know, whatever. Because those guys were actually closer to him. But I'm just not going to talk about si about the science of it, but whatever. 
The point is a turtle is attacking a book, yes. This is great. This is a great thing. What was that? I just heard something. I heard a something, guys. Don't even worry about it. I heard a something. Uh, and once again, guys, I just want to clarify that even... I know a lot of you guys can guess that it, when ore spawn gets um, summoned up, that th all the ore spawn mobs are going to kick the face in of everything. And that's not necessarily true, because I'm not really judging it by individual mobs. I'm judging it by the mod, at, or, or vanilla, I guess, as a whole. I'm going to see the average of what round they got, give them a certain amount of points, and then we'll see who won by that. Because these are guys that are really on a team, and if two mobs from the same mod end up fighting each other, I'm going to fix that. Or maybe I won't, I'm not sure. It depends on how easy it is to fix. Oh god, he's going so intense. So, oh, he's almost below 50. You guys are about to see the regen attack. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that, that's really indestructible. I'm going to guess that's at least 10 hit points a second. That's ridiculous. Look at the regeneration on this thing. What is wrong with you, dude? What are you? What are you? Okay, I want to make you attack this guy. Kick him in the face. Okay, and he's back to full health. Here we go. It's as if they never even had, like... Yeah, this guy is going to kick him in the face really badly. Okay, fine. Attack this guy, then. Kick him in the face. Oh, here we go. Oh, that guy's dead. Oh, man, it's just up to this guy here. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, I thought he was dead. He's not dead yet. Turtle boss, you gotta finish him off. Oh my god, the intent. I really gotta stop yelling. I'm getting really... The yelling isn't making this any more entertaining, I swear. Uh, yeah. Turtle boss, yes. Kick him in the face. I know you can. I believe in you. I don't believe in you. You suck. But, you know, I, I mean, I, yeah, he, he doesn't suck. He doesn't suck. He's awesome. Kick him in the face, turtle boss. Yes. So majestic. Oh, wow. That... Aren't your arms and limbs supposed to be in the shell at all times during that? I mean, okay, whatever, whatever, you win, you win, congratulations, you get killed. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, feel free to like or subscribe. Also, post in the comments what you want from the channel, whether it's, I don't know, a different game or something totally not related to Minecraft, or whether it's Minecraft at all. I don't know. Just post something. Whatever. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all later.